Hi, and thank you for tuning in to Happy Duck Sheds at Claude. Wanted to show you this cabin model that we have. Mostly because it's just very impressive to me. I love this thing. This is like the house for when you don't want the house. All the windows. It's got the standard four foot porch on this one. You can get it a six foot porch if you want to. It's all built just like the rest of it. It's all treated wood floor joists, 16 inch centers. We'll go in here real quick. I know it's not a whole lot to see in here, except it's really impressive. I'm standing with a window to my back. I've got two windows there and two windows over there. And this building is a 14 by 36. You can actually have four more feet added to it and make it a 14 by 40. Or you can make it even bigger. And this doesn't have lofted storage in it. So as an example, you can customize this one and it can be a 16 foot wide. And these are the building sizes. And this is the cabin. And I'm spending time on it because I want you to have enough time to be able to see it. Pause it, whatever you want to do, take a picture of it with your phone, okay? And then I want you to see the warranty on all Grayson buildings. Does not apply to repos. If, if you end up buying one that somebody else already rented and it got repoed, it won't have the warranties on it. On the other hand, there is a little bit of savings because it is a repo instead, but repos don't happen very often. If you want to pause it for this, you can also. This, is, this isn't like any, any secret agenda or anything like that. You, and these are the standard features for all Gracelands. And I'll show you the aluminum soffit vent system in a little bit. Keeps your, keeps your building from turning into a hot box. Okay? All right, so one other thing I want to show you is there's a reflective layer under the OSB that is the roof. They've, the walls are 5 8 inch plywood. Okay? You're not going to put a sledgehammer through that and be able to break into the building at any time. OSB, I am not as much in faith of OSB as a siding as some other people are. 16 inch center gives me a lot of room to, to move on an OSB. Whereas if you're trying to get through a piece of plywood, I don't think I can put my foot through a piece of plywood 16 inch centers. These are dual pane thermal windows. I always encourage everybody to do dual pane thermal windows if they're doing windows just because it keeps the building from getting hot. And then I'm six foot one and these are eight foot walls. And I always tell people you want to get the eight foot walls just because the extra space gives you a little bit of room to breathe. And I know you're like, why am I looking at these studs? Well, these studs are all 16 inch centers. We call it a cabin for a reason. It's pretty much going to match up to about any HUD requirement on any building. If you want to use this as a basis for being able to build a tiny home off of, it would be awesome. We also have the barn uh, lofted barn cabin models and with an eight foot wall in them, those are also awesome for building a tiny home, tiny home in. But I wanted you to see this just because it's one of those buildings that it's full of light. If there was another window on the back, that would be nice too. But if you're using it for a tiny home, maybe you want to put a good sized bathroom in the back with a giant tub and all that. And then here's your, here's your bedroom windows and then you build a partition wall and you have in a front, uh, living room up front. It'd be what you would want to do. 
but there are a lot of people in the tiny home movement are actually doing this right now. And it just matters on how many extra custom options you want to add to it as to what it's going to cost to build it. But the reflective ceiling makes a lot. It's very nice in here right now. It's 87 degrees outside and uh, you know, so all the windows are shut, the door is shut, and I'm comfortable in here. It's not hot, it's not cold, it's comfy. So we're gonna go back out real quick and I'm gonna show you the softed vent system. This porch is nice and comfy to sit on. Point it to the west and watch the sun go down off your front porch. But I want to show you this real quick. That's the aluminum vented and soft soffit system. And then you can see up there on the cap row, on the cap of this building, there's a little bit of vintage up there. Because hot air is going to rise and leave. Now if you're going to go ahead and, and, and trim it in and, and uh, wallboard it up and text, tape the texture, that's going to take away from the top part. But if you build it like an attic type thing, then it will let the building breathe. And that actually will meet a lot of the housing requirements for buildings made in this modern era. So that is our cabin. This is a 14 by 36. This is Happy Duck Sheds. Thank you very much for watching. Have a fantastic and blessed day.